specifically tonight? Uh, as far as personally, personally, personally yeah. Um, I think I did a pretty good job for the experiments I was in. Um, first half, uh, didn't play as much with the second half. I came in, uh, just trying to just readjust my mindset, have uh, really good energy on the glass. I think I had like seven rebounds in like one minute. So try to just go after every rebound. They just that's what they've been preaching me in practice every day. Just uh, keep my motor going up every time I set a ball screen, sprint to it, uh, and just do a lot of the little things, and everything else will come. <clears throat> try not to force anything. Because uh, once you do all the other things, everything, all the scoring can come and all the other stuff. Yeah. So just the intangibles. Is that, uh, is that an easy lesson for you to, to grasp? But you know, yeah. the offense will take care of itself. Um, I mean, at first it's kind of uh, it's hard to understand. Just you know, doing those little things, scoring will come. But once you realize you can do it, um, the first couple of games I did it. And uh, practice I do every day, so it's just uh, it's getting easier to understand. You know, if you rebound, block shot, um, set a hard ball screen, you know, you'll get open, and that'll be able to let my game flourish. And uh, I already have a good, a good amount of skill, so I can just use my skill once I do all the little things. Yeah, you were called for a couple of traveling. Yeah, I mean, is that something you and Juwan, or I imagine footwork and stuff? Yeah, um, you guys are working on? One of them I thought was iffy, and they also uh, looked iffy too. But um, one of them I picked up my uh, pivot foot and. I felt it too. I kind of should have just went up my left hand, uh, the one where I drove left handed. I just finished with my left hand. So that just comes with more game time and, uh, you know, confidence and stuff like that. So. What, what were you seeing from both the bench and then when you got in the game kind of kind of early because you guys were kind of yeah. doing your way? Yeah, um, I feel like it just took us a couple minutes to just get in the groove. Um, kind of just adjust to how they play and their play style. You know, they really used the elbows well with their big men. Um, and they had a lot of backdoor cuts. And I feel like we guarded it very well. Um, the coaches did a great job of preparing us the two days before practice. And uh, I think we did a pretty good job defending them. First half, we won, probably should have. Um, we held them to a pretty good uh, standard, usually. It was like 21 points, but then they came out and scored a little bit too much. Um, but then we slowed it down a little bit more. So. Their one guard was really good, though. Uh, yeah, I don't know, I forgot his name. But Sheffield. Yeah, Sheffield was great. I was just going to ask him, um, you know, going in, he was their leading scorer. Mm -hmm. Is there any thought of, okay, he might yeah. get his but contain the other guys? Um, yeah, we didn't really have that mindset. We just knew he was a really good uh, transfer, high level IQ guard. Um, he, I believe he came from Stanford as well. So yeah. uh, he knows how to play the game, and he just got to a really hard, hot start. Whenever you have that hot hand, um, I feel like in the basket there, you just keep coming back to it. And he just, a lot of his shots were just falling. So we had to try to main, contain him and stop him as best as we could. <clears throat> Balanced scoring for you guys tonight. How much is, are the coaches dialing up certain guys versus uh, yeah, just kind yeah. of free flowing action? Um, I think yeah. we're not really dialing up people in particular. I think we're just letting our offense do the talking and the work. Um, definitely exploiting <clears throat> mismatches with John and stuff like that. Um, and then when I'm in, just try to you know do my best job doing the same thing. And if I don't get the ball, just go for a rebound because I have a small guy on me. Box him out and go get it. Uh, but definitely exploiting mismatches as far as John because he's such a big body. And so it's good around the basket. So, you know, he does his part every game. So. Eight rebounds tonight. That's what I'm, you feel like is your role. You're going to try to come in. Just yeah. Um, he preaches it to me every day. Just go after every rebound. You know, whenever you're in, just affect the game however you can. You know, uh, if I make a mistake, just move on from it. Because that's a really big tendency of mine. Just, you know, making a mistake and getting down on myself. So I've just been working on, you know, if I make a mistake, like I made the travel, I, I dropped it. Next play, got a block. So little stuff like that. Um, just quick and going on to the next play. But rebounding has definitely been my number one uh, focus recently. And he's been he's been all on the whole team, honestly. But in particular, Biggs, me and John, he's just been working on his boxing out and, you know, going to get those rebounds because we, we can do it. What about your uh, offensive approaches? Are more likely just letting it come to you? Um, I mean, right now, yeah, in the year, just trying to figure everything out. Uh, when more playing, the more playing time, you know, just feeling it out, getting more comfortable little by little. Um, I feel comfortable now, but just those little mistakes I made to travel. So but that'll come. But just, you know, I, I feel confident out there on the offensive floor. But, uh, you know, just keep staying confident and going into my moves. Talking, think about, it's, talking about your confidence, what are some of the specific things that Coach Howard is doing to build your confidence? Uh, you know, just saying the same things every day, you know, uh, preaching the same things into our ears every day. So we hear it every single day, you know, whether it's film, walkthroughs, practice, when he, when he sees us outside practice, you know, just, you know, just implementing that into our heads so we can hear positive things, positive thoughts, no matter what it is on the court, just, you know, telling us that he trusts us, you know, and having a coach that trusts you, you know, gives you a lot of confidence and stuff like that. So that's part of the biggest thing is him just trusting us and instilling that in us and letting us know every day. Offensively, what did you see in the first half that you can maybe see some room for improvement on? 
Um, I think Coach Howard told us in halftime uh, a little bit of you know just being stagnant and not who the boss was. We've struggled before with that in the last two games, but um, we got better at the second half. You know, just moving the ball. Uh, me and Johnny got us about just spreading the ball screens, having a little bit more of energy. Um, and we did a better job rebounding, I think, on the offensive side, but <clears throat> just moving the ball more, not getting one pass, one shot, uh, and just getting a couple. He wanted, you know, five or six passes and stuff like that. Just move the ball, keep the ball moving. And it'll find energy and it'll score. Do you think, uh, you know, the defense and rebounding, do you think that correlates with you getting more playing time? 100%. Yeah, I think, um, you know, at the end of the day, uh, I'm behind one of the best center in the country. So, you know, I got to find my niche and find out, uh, you know, when I can get opportunities and when I do get opportunities you know just go in there and play as hard as I can whether that be rebounding defense blocking shots I feel like I got to just affect the game somehow um, and just be very aggressive so that's my mindset and I feel like I said already everything else will come so just being aggressive. Is that difficult as you mentioned you stagnant and moving the ball I guess but the tower creatures opening like, yeah. the shots so far is that just a kind of tricky uh, uh, not really because um, you know, like I said he trusts us 